What's up, peeps, and welcome back to the Lionel Beast Show. It's your first time tuning into the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the videos, man. Also, make sure y'all click that notification bell button so anytime I drop a brand new video, y'all be the first ones to get it. Now, some of y'all, if y'all are not receiving my brand new videos, man, make sure you hold down the bell button and make sure it says all instead of personalized. Now, and also, make sure y'all follow me on my Instagram. That's at the Lionel B Show. Now, these friends ain't loyal, and that's clearly evident with Ryan Henry, star of Black Ink Chicago. Now, his best friend just exposed a reality star recently after finding out that his baby mama and Ryan was smashing for over a year. Now, that's not even the worst of it. At the time, his best friend was battling cancer. And Ryan's response to the evidence is just crazy. Now, y'all watch this video to its entirety so you can be filled in on all the crazy behind details. Now, his friend dropped some information out, man. He actually wrote it out on his notepad. And I guess he, you know, he felt some type of way, of course. You know what I'm saying? Pretty foul stuff, man. But he says, I've been debating over a week about sharing this. Everyone says, don't run the social media. We run the social media for our joys, but hide our lows. Well, I'm at my lowest point I've ever been in in my life. I found out last week via my son's mother text that her and Ryan, my best friend and father to my godson, has been effing each other for over a year and a half. Damn! It took so much of a toll, I ended up ODing last week. Did I want to off myself? No. The overwhelming pain and me being distraught led me down a path I had never faced. Being that yesterday's was mental health day, I decided to share this. Both of my sons have been affected immensely. Caden didn't deserve this. I didn't deserve this. We were brothers. This isn't for a show, which everyone seems to think. Nah, this is my life. If you know or follow me, you know I hold my son's mother with the highest regard as well as Ryan. They did this to me while I fought cancer. I'm broken, hurt, confused, and so many other things. It's been a week and she's tired of talking about it. LOL. I can't believe either gives a F about me. Period. My son asked to go to Ryan's but says... I want to see the boys, not Ryan. He says he doesn't want to see Ryan because Ryan and mommy did something to you. He's four. Why is this his life? Ryan made the mental health posted, but destroyed mine. Now, this is crazy. Now, in the leaked text messages, man, this actually I'm showing right now on the screen. This is clearly uh, a text message he got from his baby mama. And it's between her and Ryan. So basically, uh, Ryan is saying, yo, but I couldn't help it. Was too fresh out that shower, LOL. And the chick said, not mad at it at all. And Ryan says, LOL, as I could see. And then she says, miss you. He says, so did I. As you could tell, hopefully, LOL. And she said, yeah, everything was just too good, LOL. And then Ryan said, why the face? And she said, because I don't like that, LOL. And he says, you don't like everything that was too good? LOL, what the hell? Then she says, LOL, I mean, I definitely loved it, but loving it like that means I'll be missing it, then needing it. He says, well, I'm hoping you do both. It's all just sitting here waiting. She said, good. Then he comes back and says, soon. And she was like, absolutely. And then she ends it with, hey, I don't know if Ant was with you last night. I can't get a hold of him and I have to work. He's supposed to be picking up K. Now, when this information came out, it seemed like Ryan Henry actually didn't give no Fs. He did respond. He went on live and he basically was pretty much making light of the situation. And not only did he do that, he also posted another video with one of his homies from Nine Mag. And he just didn't give no F, man. Check out this clip where Ryan is responding to those allegations. So he's making himself look worse. Look worse to who? Y'all don't like me anyway. I don't like y'all. Y'all don't like me anyway. Is he making himself look worse? Worse to what? Y'all don't like me anyway. Y'all don't even know what's real behind that story. I'm not gonna say anything. I'm definitely not gonna say anything. 
You know what I mean? What's going it's on? Not it's, black and white is out there. It's, de it's, a, it's definitely a lot of people that want to say a lot of. Not black you know what I mean? White. I take my punches on the chin. Gonna, gonna I take my punches all the way on the chin. Talk, but uh, gonna I ain't gonna say gonna nothing. But <laughs> don't get no lies. I don't be threatening no nothing. I, uh, don't let no. Come on, man. What I look like? I can't. I can't. I can't. So uh, yeah, man. It is what it is. Off of now, you definitely got to take that word friend lightly. You know what I'm saying? And especially best friend. I mean, how does that your best friend, bro? Like, I mean, it's hard to find a real friend, let alone a damn best friend. Now, he actually put out some more information. He said, I appreciate the support. Just don't comment on my son, period. Also, I can't allow slander on posts with my son about his mom. That will always be his mother, and I will always honor that. I am who I am, and they won't change that. Now, it seems like that lady is one hell of a lady, man. If he got her, you know, pretty much protecting her after she been cheating on you for a year and a half. Call it simping, call it whatever it is. Uh, Lionel B ain't ever finna go for that. But then, you know what I'm saying, he actually showed some footage of him and Ryan's better days. Check this out. Kids, mom, my friend. Rachel. My man, Bert. They're doing me this whole journey, man. Like, today, we be kind of free. Like, it's crazy. Like, mm -hmm. like, I always believed in my heart that I was going to beat this shit. This nigga, even when I didn't believe it, he would like, Nigga, for Katie, for Katie, for Katie, for Katie, for Katie, for Katie. But the, the, the doctor called me and said, um, it's zero detection. I'm like, huh? <laughs> 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 zero detection. I'm like, so it's nothing? He's like, nothing. I'm like, you talk zero. I'm like, zero. He like, you want to say zero, nigga? So, man, this has been zero, man. The, I appreciate the people that lit me up. Because I couldn't hit it without support, man. I'd have gave up, I swear to God. In this other clip, man, tattoo artist at Nine Mag, he basically wanted to post up. I guess he was pretty much trying to throw shots at Ryan's former best friend. And he actually posted a video with Ryan saying, man, it don't matter. We can smash the same chicken. We ain't never going to have no issue. Y'all yeah, check out this effery. So y'all definitely need to watch out who y'all call y'all friends, man. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about this, man. How do y'all feel about Ryan Henry smashing the homies chick, bro? Like, that's really foul. And not just smashing, but smashing her for over a year and a half. That sounds like a whole entanglement. So y'all let me know how y'all feel about this, man. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the videos. Share these videos. And I'm going to peep y'all on the next one. Holla.